there. Hey, it's Kara. <laughs> Handy Kara. Um, I've been sheltering in place like everybody else in Illinois and redoing my basement bathroom. I haven't taken video of it because it's hard when you're doing stuff by yourself to hold a camera. But I figured I'd show you how to install this mirror. I installed one in my basement bathroom that's round, which is really easy because it's so forgiving. Um, this is square, so I'm a little bit more interested in this, <laughs> but we'll see how this goes. Now it's a beveled mirror. This is the attaching mechanism. So you can actually have it rectangular, um, you know, vertical or horizontal. I'm gonna have it horizontal over this here. So your first step is to really you're supposed to have two people at this point. I just wrote on my newly painted walls. Gosh darn it. Um, anyway, uh, but I already did this by myself because that's how Handy Kara rolls. So I marked up on top right here. That was the center of the mirror. Then I measured three inches down. And then as an extra precaution, I actually made a pencil mark dead center of this as well so that I know it's centered. Uh, now I got to figure out the holes I'm going to drill. Don't let drilling scare you. So this is the three inches down below the center of the mirror. I'm going to put a level on this to make sure the mirror is, oops, <laughs> is level. Any camera isn't so perfect. You'll find out in a moment. Oh, where is it? Okay. All right, let's see. All right, that looks pretty good. So I'm going to go in these circles. Now I know where to drill. But here's a trick. If you don't know what size a drill bit is, it is written in teeny, tiny, teeny, tiny writing. You need like glasses and a light to see it, but it's there because I wasn't sure. I had to make sure I can't even focus it. It's, it's there. Believe me, this is a quarter inch. <laughs> so now that I know where to drill. All right, now it's time to put these babies in for the nails. I did not bring my hammer up, so hopefully it'll go in. Okay, that's pretty good. That's actually pretty good. I found my hammer. <laughs> so let's just make sure these are flush against the wall. All right. All right, now it's time to drill these babies in. Uh, tip, I was gonna say pro tip, but I'm not a pro. Whenever I'm working over a sink, I always, always Close the drain <laughs> if something can fall down it because Murphy's Law. Oh, actually, I should probably put the thing up first. I love this way of hanging up a mirror so much. And if I did it right, you'll see why. It's super easy to hang it. And if I measure it right, that's the big if. Uh, it should be completely centered. So, and level. Hey, now. That looks pretty good. Let me get you a better look at it. Look at that. Handy Kara does it again. Woohoo! 